For this um, Washa SCADA project, so, so for that one, so we have to install a new system and install an integrated to remotely monitor for these systems. There is six function will be integrated here. Like one is uh, water level, pressures, the flow meters, and uh, the chlorometers and that um, one for the energy consumption for the full systems that will be monitored from the remotely Dhaka Washa main office now if you've got a SCADA system if everything is all right you always see two straight lines depending on morning afternoon and evening if uh, something happens in the pipeline when a big birth and water is flowing out Pressure always goes down, the flow always goes up. So you will see that after five minutes in the in the scatter system, you will take you see you will see this graph. So we will see that the flow of waters and the pressure of the waters, okay, and level of the waters, and uh, we can monitor remotely, and that uh, the system will be go very smooth and uh, the maintenance purpose and there's um, operation will be make uh, flexible to the people of this washer who will maintain that washer network, water network. <laughs> We are going to try to find the leak. Find out the leak. We will find out the leak. We know the leak, but we do not know. Yeah. Okay. We do not know. We fix a position. Uh, I would like to close bulb 2, 5, 13 and 10. After 5 minutes, what will be the position? Graph. Good. Yes. Good. So, after 5 minutes, uh, Skara says... Skara says... Good. So, and bad. So okay. Lots of tasks I have to do yeah. because the last portion is under Yes. And right now we are changing the connection and teach the people how to use the new equipment for better connections. And it will make the proper insulations, which is will be waterproof and others. Okay. So and no others to harm the motors. Okay. It will make the safety of this motor. This is the level transmitter. That's connected to the pipe, so, so and when the pipe is uh, lowered into the ground, it will uh, be below, below the water surface, and then it will measure the level of the water surface below the, uh, above the pump. Oh, uh, normally the water level will be around 10 meters above the motor. Uh, we place the water transmitter on the on, on a lowest pipe, so it will measure about 10 meters water pressure level. Uh, install the pressure switch over here to measure the chlorinator status. That says the chlorine cylinder is empty or no. The system will uh, report that that the chlorine cylinder is empty. Now you have to replace. And in fact, it is the service will be more flexible. And uh, due to the pressure uh, that uh, systems, there is a lot of actually, a lot will be integrated. Some of the leakage systems will be determined yeah. later on. Okay, so that what if anywhere in the water is the leakage. Nowadays, we are the manually, we have to find out is where is leakage and others, but it will be remotely monitored. And we, there is a system to be integrated that so that the leakage will be maintained so that that much and particularly the distance of the leakage they will show and they will report it the maintenance people maintenance will go and repair it faster okay that's what's the essential of the system